Here are a few apps to get 2019 started off with. First app we have is Pictures. Pictures is a gallery app with a different and very nice look to it. The app has you use left and right swipes to get to your picture folders. It uses a parallax effect for the preview at the top of the open folder. There is access to your cloud services in the app, calendar view, beam to TV, no ads and more. Try it today, you may actually like it. The next app on the list is Clipboard Actions. This app allows for the user to copy and paste using the app, but you can also swipe down from the notification shade and define, share, translate, and more with the click of a button. The app is smooth and it saves your past copies. The app is free, but you can always donate. Next we have Snapseed. This app is actually great for anyone who has a phone that they use for social media or a person who just edits photos. You can edit regular JPEG and even raw files. Pictures can be edited with filters, fixed blemishes, red eye, and much more. The app has so many possibilities with it. You can do so much with it and it is very useful. Microsoft Launcher. This is a very capable everyday launcher. It's very customizable and intuitive. Personal feeds and calendar events can be set up along with the ability to set up many gestures. Another good feature is the ability to link your phone with Windows PC, which will allow for things like pictures that's been taken on the phone to be viewed on your computer. If you're looking for a good app for scores, stats, sports news and all, the score is for you. This app will give great information live and team stats along with the app having information from across many sports, leagues, professional and college ranks. There is the ability to also pick your favorite teams so that you can receive notifications on important information pertaining to those teams. Also on the news side of things, Geek Tech is a news app geared towards basically anything tech related. Once you download it, there will be a series of possible keywords that can be liked and once done, you're good to go with news from many different websites in an interface that's easy to work with and clean. This app was a great replacement for a news app that I once had, but it was shut down. If you're a forgetful person like I am, Idea Note might be for you. It can use speech recognition to take down notes while also reminding you through audio and even pictures. The app can be themed and the notes are neatly organized with a great look to them. And the last app, Gcam. This is a camera app that is side loaded onto your device. You will need to set your phone to download apps from untrusted sources. Once allowed, if your phone has a version online, check on XDA to see it for a download. Now, you can take pictures with a modded version of the Pixel camera app. These are a few sample photos from my LG V20. Thanks for watching. Happy New Year's and have a great 2019. Later.